Hello and what is up everybody, I am Ender Slasher and welcome back to another video, another series, we're in a new game, and it's called Tropico 5, it's XX amount on Steam, and yeah, we are going to jump right in, and now we're going to make a new game. We are going to do the campaign. The main campaign. New Dynasty, we shall call it Ender Slasher. Okay, so basically it's kinda like Sim City except not. It's like you rule an island and you have to manage and build the city of the island. Perfect. Okay. I need the hat. Yeah, there we go. That should work. Skip. <laughs> medium, medium, occasional, and... Um, let's go with this one. Ah, the Caribbean. A lush and untamed land. My new home. Beautiful land. Full of promise. A new beginning, far from the politics of the old world. A chance to start fresh and do things my way. I'm tired of the musty weather and rigid thinking back home. I need a change. I was appointed governor of this island. Not that anyone else wanted the job anyway. My unique approach to government will make this colony the most prosperous in the Caribbean. <laughs> How hard can it be? You just need some planks, a few nails, and a trusty advisor to shout at. Welcome to the Caribbean, Governor. Allow me to introduce myself, Lord Oaksworth, His Majesty's emissary to the region. All right, so that was the introduction. And, yep, and he's given me this colony to rule for a number of years, four years to be exact. And within those four years, I have to extend my mandate to a longer. Jeff, have I got a deal for you today. Hmm. As crown representative, I can offer you your very own... Give me that one. Okay, now let's immediately build a bunch of docks. And options, let me just turn down the music just a tad. Alright. His Majesty needs money. Alright, so as you can see, it's kind of city building esque game. And so we just put a logging camp to take care of all these trees, make some money from those. And we're going to need to extend the road out to there and there. And then I think, okay, that one's already an elevator, that one's an elevator. I think that we need to explore. Right there. 
So we'll go explore over there. Speed up the game. So that it doesn't take forever. Go to ranch. Ranches are pretty good. Okay. I'm gonna need to hook that up with a road. Alright. And here's the build menu. You can build a bunch of things. You can unlock more through, like, research. Kind of like Civilization V. Hmm. Through this research tab, I say I want mines. And then that one and that one. And yeah, we just wait and see what, and we get His little quests to do to that give us. And why are you not finished building? No, you don't get that much money. And then you can set the budget for buildings that determines their effectiveness. Technological progress is the path. Okay, library. Building a library. Nobody wants to build it. Nope, that's that. I think people are building it now. You can see the little people running about and little birds flying overhead. Very neat game. Trade. Uh, we don't have any trade routes active. Do we have pineapples? I think we have some pineapples. Now that's corn, okay. No, we don't want to import corn. No, we can export meat. Meat's pretty good. Uh, sorry that I skipped that, I just want to do that. Alright, now let's read this. That move the world. We rule in secret. We are the salvation of mankind. We are the order, and you will be one of us. Alright, so these are basically the people who control the strings of the world, and yeah. And he wants me to join their order of controlling the world, I guess. <laughs> we have to declare independence from the clown from the crown, and for that we need popular support above fifty percent. And that will win the mission for us, and then we shall move on to the next campaign mission. Okay, got the library done. Needs people. Uh, four people left, Tropico. Hmm. And we can open the almanac and see why. People are not happy. People are homeless. People are unemployed. People are probably hungry too. Homeless and hungry. I understand you are still struggling with trivial things like money. I will aid you this time, but remember, I offer my help only once. Hmm. I will take this money for myself. Because I'm a greedy governor. Let's build a guard tower. Like right there. Being able to stand on your own is a virtue I personally cherish. Self-sufficiency should be every country's goal. I will accept that challenge.
put you on high since we've done the castle of the ranches. And then we can see our balance and revenue and expenses. Why are we so expensive? Okay, so let's see. Top export is corn. We get a lot from corn. We earn some from residencies. We're losing a lot from constructions. And that's just because we've got a bunch of things that are building, I suppose. Although, how they do the budgets and balances in this game is a very weird. Good, we're exporting. Ew, iron is selling for a lot. We don't have any iron. That's gonna need to be a priority. Hmm. My okay. good fellow, I have it from a very reliable source that Ah gold in them their hills, boy. I suggest you send some men to find it. Okay. Hey. And then the we've got ruling twists our perception of humanity. To us and then people are just a resource that has to be managed properly. We need five new country houses. Okay. Let's um, First let's Send you guys out to his it. royal majesty has instructed me to present you with this letter of commendation for your achievements in the name of send them all the way up there come on you trade ships You're supposed to be exporting meat I say being a crown colony is a kind of competition. One you are losing, old chap. The colonies of Puerto Coco and Isla Rojo <laughs> are beating you badly. Uh, don't have much money. But let's just pay the tax. I mean, better not to go at war with somebody bigger than you. For now, that is... Oh, yay, we're finally researching. Thirteen months. Okay, how's unemployment doing, I wonder? Three open jobs at nine. Alright, yep, that's good. And then, as soon as we get we can't build anything and we have under negative 10,000 in our treasury so we just need to wait till we get some more money and then we can build some country houses is this one gonna be a gold deposit I wonder let's see it is a coal deposit. Okay. Well. Alright, now let's just look at the trades. Ooh! Never mind. I'm gonna trade this. Tobacco, I don't have tobacco. Gold. Planks. Don't have any planks. Do you, however, have some logs? Okay, there's some money, so... Now that we have money, let's immediately spend that money. Restaurant, we don't have enough. Still. Hmm. Let's just put a grocery. 
Groceries are helpful. I think. Still, the music's a bit loud. There we go. That's good, built awfully quickly. Well off. Visitors, you're out of 500. Out of 150. We have food, yes. We don't have any profit from it, though. President, as you know, it is your will alone that keeps Tropico together. Without you, the entire island would crumble to dust and be lost forever. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see. It's on. It's completely obvious that we should have a singing. As the was born, all animals became quiet. A light shone through the skies, and La Chupacabra herself went to the crib and bowed to the infant. At least, that is what we will write in the history books. <laughs> that is very cool. And we shall... Finance it. Hmm. Yep, yeah, that I think that will be good. Sure, exit that. His name. Majesty has commissioned the finest architects to design his new underwater home. We need your cash crops to pay for them. Okay, export sugars. Do we have any trade options to export sugar? No, we can import sugar. And then, nope, can't export any of that stuff. Could export coffee. Do I... can I build a plantation? Nope, plantations are too expensive. So I guess we just kind of gotta wait. Sugar and corn. Hmm. <laughs> okay, that's not that much money. Exporting meat. Some logs. Planks. Can't, don't have planks. That. Yeah, we unlocked the mine. Forty times. If I find out who put it there, I will kill him. Anyway, I gave it to the miners so they can put it somewhere safe. Like, like underground? Boy, this guy's a genius, right? I'm glad he's my top researcher. <laughs> so now we can just build a mine and a road before we run out of money. And yes! And come on, finish you mine. There we go. We have a mine. Anyway. Did you know that there are treasures buried on our island? We should investigate. <laughs> wow. Strange looking man. And sort of genuine treasure map. Wow. Thanks to your efforts, 
The revolutionary movement is growing stronger. Let's see, I will take new trade routes. I still just want meat and tobacco and planks. Because I want some logs now though. Ah, I wish I had some gold. But now we can remove a ship from that and add it to iron. And anyway guys, I think that's the end of the episode. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe for if you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next episode. Bye!